on everyone, welcome to the channel. And if you're new here to GQR, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We do Gentleman's Park to View Style and Fitness here, so if you're about that, go ahead and hit that button right down there. Welcome everyone. So today we're going to be going over a face scrub and a moisturizer by a company called Triumph and Disaster. And we're going to be checking out their face scrub and the moisturizer to see how good it is. But just like anything on this channel, it's going to be going over a couple things. We're going to be checking out the packaging, the scent, the texture, the application, and then my overall verdict on these two products. So let's go ahead and get right into this and get right into the packaging. All right, everyone, let's go ahead and take a look at the packaging. So as you can see, this is a 5.11 ounce plastic container all the way around. In the front, it says rock and roll face scrub and a tramp and disaster. And it's just really nice. Just a plastic container all the way around. Um, Right there on the sides, it has the directions, the ingredients, and then right there it says rock and roll face scrub. It just tells you some things about it and nothing at the bottom. And just really nice. I really love this. It just feels like a, basically like a pomade container. I love the color scheme, the black and the white, and um, definitely really nice for a face scrub. And then the moisturizer, as you can see, comes in this beautiful box. It says Game Face Moisturizer, Triumph and Disaster, and then a couple things, the ingredients. And a couple things about it right there and if you open it up let's go ahead and take a look at this you see you go ahead and get the actual container it says right there and it's just a beautiful container i love the little one thing you can just set it down like that and it just stands and it's like an aluminum tube and um very nice packaging definitely definitely love the color scheme on this too so both of them are really nice definitely like it so let's go ahead and go over the scent. So let's go ahead on the rock and roll face scrub first. Let's open this up. And oh man, it has a really, really nice scent. Now, because of the volcanic ash and um, all this natural ingredients in here, it has a really nice earthy scent to it. Re I mean, you can definitely smell the volcanic ash in here. It smells really nice, real earthy, real fresh. Definitely a refreshing scent. It's just really, really nice. So let's go ahead and now check out the moisturizer and we'll go ahead and check out that scent and it's definitely a nice scent it's not really um too big of a scent it's actually really light real earthy scent real nice real smell almost i want to say it's almost like a blend smell which is great so then that way um you know if it's certain scents you um you're sensitive to scents you don't like that you put it on your face it just almost like a scentless scent so it's actually pretty nice i like it Right, everyone, let's go ahead and take a look at the texture so as you can see the game face moisturizer I mean it's just a typical cream guys there's nothing really different about it it's just gonna be a cream texture I mean it is a cream so it's just like any other cream so we're not really gonna take too much a look at that but let's go ahead and take a look at the rock and roll face scrub which is actually very unique and as you can see there is some clay in here and some volcanic ash and just really amazing ingredients and it's just super easy to scoop out and as you can see it's just very nice it breaks up super smooth just like a cream would and it just breaks up real nice now it is a little bit once you start breaking it up you can feel the ash and it almost feels like super light sandpaper just really nice you can tell it's just a real awesome exfoliator as soon as you start to break up in the hand so we'll definitely be taking a look at that in the i want to see the application but as you can see the texture is just nice it smells great Definitely, definitely. Um, Alright everyone, so let's go over the application. So let's go ahead and get into the space scrub. And let's open this up. And you know, I really love the packaging of this. It just reminds me like I'm opening up a pomade or something. So let's go ahead and just a little bit of this. You don't need too much of it. I usually get around a dime size of it. It's like if I was to use like a pomade. Just a little bit goes a long way. So let's go ahead and wet my hand real quick. Let's get nice and wet. And I'm gonna go ahead and put this on right there just go ahead and start moving around and it just it's gonna feel like mud and you just go ahead and get well i want to emulsify it break it up like you would any face wash as you can see and then just go ahead and start getting it in there and as you can see just it starts looking like you're putting mud on your face and it's just exfoliating really nice it feels like just a real life scratch on your face made a little bit more water on here And it's just really nice. It just feels real fresh. You get that nice earthy scent on there. And you can go ahead and just scrub as hard as you want. But you don't really need to go really hard on there. Just a real light, just how I'm doing it. And it just feels really, really good. So let's go ahead and wash this off. And we'll get back right now. All right, let's go ahead and just pat it down. I just finished washing it off. And my skin feels really great. Just really refreshed. 
feels really really nice so after we're done with that let's go ahead and get this moisturizer on there and let's try this out and then this is just really nice packaging like I said you don't really need too too much just a little bit sometimes the moisturizer goes a long way and I just like to put little dabs first where I want to put it on there and let's go ahead and go in and just goes in really smooth really nice like I said the scent isn't very strong and right away it just goes so good with the with the face scrub mask that we used and it's just really nice real smooth moisturizer feels great on the skin and as you can see my skin looks great I've been using this product already for a couple months and it just man my face feels amazing so as you can see the application was really great I definitely liked it for everyone so let's go ahead and give this my overall verdict so from one being the least and five being the best I definitely want to give this a solid five plus man this these products were really amazing I've tried a lot of different kinds of uh, face scrubs and moisturizers and let me tell you these are definitely some of the best I've ever ever used definitely and um, let's go ahead and talk about some of the ingredients because that's obviously the ingredients are what Triumph and Disaster is known for is just having amazing ingredients and um, let's talk about the face scrub first and obviously this this has volcanic ash which is really really great it's an organic matter it's um really great for i want to say it perfectly with natural clays and for deep exfoliation so that's definitely very good for your skin it also has green green clay which is great for blackheads and drawn out dirt it's uh, nourishing and uh, rich in iron magnesium and potassium so that's obviously just really really awesome products that um definitely you want to have and they're actually very very unique so that's always what makes triumph and disaster products just really really obviously just stand out that are way different than any other product so let's talk about the game face moisturizer and that also has really really amazing products let's go ahead and check these out so the ingredients obviously one of them is a uh, jojoba oil which is really really nice and it just has it's basically absorbs and it works with your skin and uh fighting against different things on there it's a non-greasy so it's just something really really great for your skin and also um it has bonga which is a uh, a friend that grows in the bottom of uh, basically at the bottom of the world in new zealand and uh, it's great it reduces wrinkles it's just natural toning tightening effect on your skin i mean it's basically like magic the stuff is really really great and there's also something called horopito which is uh, basically it grows in new zealand's back country it's a very very awesome antioxidant conditioning agent for your face so just awesome ingredients in here that just basically makes this an awesome product so definitely a solid five and like i said i've been using these products for months now and i mean my skin looks great it's really really nice um like i said the face scrub you use it i want to say just once a week and the moisturizer you can use it on a daily basis so definitely two great products these are two products you should definitely check them out well everyone i hope you enjoyed this uh, video i definitely enjoyed making it for you guys don't forget to subscribe don't forget to follow me on instagram and tell my subscribers you know i love you guys thank you so much and i'll see you next time on gqr style and fitness